Hi, I'm Kelly Moffat, and I've been a Girls Right Now mentor for two years. My mentee, Jessica Jang, is honestly one of my favorite people. Whether meeting bleary-eyed on Sunday mornings at a bookshop or on FaceTime during COVID times, she never fails to enlighten me with her writing. She's even working on a full-length novel. I'll never not be impressed by this budding author. Take it away, Jessica. Hello, my name is Jessica, and I'm not as great as Kelly says, but Kelly is really, really awesome. And I could not imagine going through the past two years without her guidance. For our pair piece, we took photos from black and white disposable cameras, and we picked four photos from each other's photography collection and wrote short stories based on them. We cannot wait for you to hear excerpts from our end product, The Suitcase of Lost Things. Please enjoy. Ritual. Every day I find my way to the folding chair. It is not comfort, but it will suffice. For I am but a man, and though you may stare, a man must sit if he is to avoid the vice. It is not comfort, but it will suffice to see the children run past free. A man must sit if he is to avoid the vice and remember what it meant to just be. To see the children run past free, I bow my head as trains rush by, and remember what it meant to just be. When I was small but felt like God and sky, I bow my head as trains rush by, gasping softly, remembering the air. When I was small but felt like God and sky, every day I find my way to the folding chair. Ode to City I think I will always love you like this. From afar, you are only an idea. I fill the space of you in my mind. I pave your streets with asphalt. I build skyscrapers and hang lights upon your windows so that you gleam. I fill you with people of all skins, of all walks of life, and of all types of love. I am still too far to feel your heartbeat, but I imagine it beneath my fingertips, pounding and trembling as tender as a baby's chest pressed against a mother's palm. Over the water you duplicate, your edges blurred and hazed as if you are Atlantis, lost but found again in my imagination. I will always remember you like this. From afar, I am not yet a stranger from a foreign land for which you are responsible, only a daughter arriving home, laden with expectations, which is to say, I still love you completely.